uh, the head of the United Nations Office for West Africa and the Sahel. The United said, Nations if Office. If the unfolding crisis in Niger is not addressed, could exacerbate the deteriorating security uh, situation in the region. The recent coup in Niger has sparked worldwide condemnation, with the West African regional bloc ECOWAS giving the co leaders one week to restore President Baum or it will choose force against them. Reacting to the ECOWAS warning to the co leaders, the UN said the decision to use force against Niger Jintas was not from them but from the regional bloc. Here's more details of that in this report. The United Nations Office for West Africa and the Sahel is disturbed that if the current coup situation in Niger is not handled urgently, it may lead to security disturbance for the whole region. Briefing reporters in New York from Ghana via video conference, Santos Simayas said the situation may negatively affect and destabilize the population of over 4 million people. He said Niger and the entire African continent do not need coup d'etat. It will also negatively impact the development and lives of the populations in a country where 4.3 million people need humanitarian assistance. Niger and the region do not need coups d'etat. Mr. Simayas said his office is supporting ECOWAS but is not directly engaged in negotiations so far. But we are fully supporting the all efforts to restore uh, Demo, uh, democratic order in that country. The decision of uh, use force, if necessary, it's, it's not a UN uh, uh, decision. It's an uh, uh, ECOWAS decision. But what we, 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 we value and we support more is that uh, all means uh, to find a, a peaceful solution for, for, for the problem should be uh, used. But I recognize also that uh, ECOWAS has the right to take other measures if they feel. The UN body responsible for Africa is afraid that the escalation of this issue may breed terrorism in the region. My concern is that uh, if uh, uh, measures are not taken uh, uh, or this rush is not reversed, it's very likely that the spread of terrorism in the region can increase. Last ordinary summit in Bissau, the decision was that uh, was twofold. One, that well, uh, uh, the region, ECOWAS, has to assist those countries in transition, namely Mali, Guinea, and Burkina Faso, to complete the process of transition through elections. Second, not accept coup d'etat anymore. When ECOWAS said that it would use force if the Niger junta refused to reinstate Basum, the Niger coup leaders, including other leaders in Mali, said they would declare war if ECOWAS was to maintain its decision. Meanwhile, the Secretary General Antonio Guterres also expressed deep concern over the reported arrest of several members of the government and urgently called for strict adherence to Niger's international human rights obligations and the prompt restoration of constitutional order. The Secretary General underscored the utmost importance of safeguarding civilians and ensuring humanitarian assistance reaches people in need in Niger. Reporting for iAfrica News, I am Maria Macham.